gonna give you a top five things to prepare for this monsoon. One. Number one would be a decent umbrella. That's right, everyone knows to get an umbrella, but how to get a decent umbrella? You can get decent umbrella actually judging from the price itself. Don't get those cheap umbrella, for heaven's sake, please don't. Reason being is when it comes to monsoon is concerned, we are talking about not only rain, but the wind as well. So, if you have the cheap umbrellas, when the hard wind comes, well, there goes your umbrella, and so does you. Some of you may think that why should I take umbrella? It looks so CC. Well, I tell you what. If you think that taking umbrella is CC, you will end up in the hospital or end up on your bed having fever for the past seven or eight days. Now, tell me who is CC? <laughs> And the second one would be a decent footwear. That's right. The importance of having a decent footwear is in order for your feet not to soak in the water when it actually contacts with water during raining season. So that is very important. Slipper is not an option. The reason being that yes, it is nice, it is, you know, it is wet, it is easy to dry, but at the end of the day, how well you dress up and you wear a slipper that doesn't give you an excuse to look bad all right why the reason being a slipper is not an option is because it looks terrible you dress up nicely on the top and look down and you have a bloody slipper on your feet which is totally not acceptable so and on top of that Crocs would be a better option. I'm talking about a shoe type of Crocs. And the third, it would be wearing dark color shirt. Why do you tell me? Reason being is very easy. Once you get wet or you have drips all around the shoulders and everywhere, it doesn't look obvious. That's the whole thing. When you wear light color, when the rain hits you, well, it does make a stain. Well, as for dark colors, it doesn't make obvious. That is the whole idea. Although it's wet, but you would not feel or see that obvious that you are soaked in the rain. And number four would be your car. That's right, your tire to be exact. Make sure your tires have enough friction to actually hold on the road. When you brake, it doesn't slip because when it rains, the road will get wet and it's bloody slippery. So if your tires go botar or doesn't have any friction, there you go. Accidents does occur very easily. Topic of the car, well, check your wipers as well so these wipers yeah it is very important and the number fifth the last but not least it would be drive carefully during the raining season because you might be careful others might not so be cautious on the road give and take it might save someone's life or even yours. All right, guys, there you go. We have five things that you need to do during this monsoon season. At least you need to prepare. All these little, little things goes a very long way. So what you're waiting for is monsoon is right here, right now. Even the sky is dark now but I'm still wearing sunglasses, I don't know why. But anyway, see you.